This week, started yesterday, is the National Sprinkler Week. So it's to raise awareness of the use of sprinkler systems within the commercial and the domestic environments. I, I would like uh, sprinkler systems to be going into every new build property as it is in Wales and Scotland, uh, especially the residential properties. That is now whenever you uh, build new properties, they have to go in, they have to be put in. But in Northern Ireland and England, we still don't have that legislation to uh, get, get the sprinkler systems installed. The benefits are that if a fire it actually develops, they are quickly identified by, by the system and they are suppressed by the, the sprinkler system and the, the, there is going to be less damage from the fire and it, it's only minimal damage from a sprinkler system as well because it will cost a bit of money. It's not as much as people think when you're doing an actual uh, new build property to actually install a, a new system. Well, so it's going to be of great benefit to a new building and also business continuity. So if you have a fire, the fire is put out and you can be back working within hours rather than it can be in weeks or you go out of business. Obviously, it's one of those things, if you don't have a fire, then you don't need it. But we never know when a fire is going to happen. That's the same as anything. It's a health and safety thing, isn't it? If someone doesn't have an accident, then they don't have an accident. If you, you pay for your car insurance, and it is, it's an insurance policy for your building and for your business. We've never had a fire death in the property in the UK from a building that's actually been sprinklered. So that's, that's amazing. So there's no doubt in my mind that sprinklers save lives. And that is a message that everyone should be aware of and not be worried about the actual costs of it because it is so important to save people's lives. You can't put a cost on a life.